Hey guys, what's going on? This is Pete, Snowshoes Nation. We're out in the woods today in New Jersey. We're going to be looking for shed antlers. Um, there used to be a bridge here at this creek, and it's gone. So you guys just bear with me while I cross. I don't kill myself and get or get soaked. So I'll be right back. Okay, everybody, we made it over the creek. Now we're into the woods. Um, again, it's Pete from uh, Snowshoes Nation. What we're doing today, we're gonna take a walk through the woods, look for game trails, and try to find shed antlers that the bucks drop. It is late February in New Jersey, and the antlers started dropping about two weeks ago. And they will continue to drop probably till early March or so. Only to give them about a month's break, a month and a half break, and then they'll start growing back again. So what you want to do when you're looking for the shed antlers, <clears throat> you want to try to find game trails. Uh, if you're unfamiliar with the woods that you're in, just got to keep your eyes peeled, watch where you're going. Look for signs or maybe rubs on trees from the fall. But again, you got to keep the watch where you're going. It's hard to see on the, the forest floor. It's like finding a needle in a haystack, finding these antlers. But they are here. And if you can find them now, it's uh, just a pretty nice little thing to have. And get out of the house, get into nature. Maybe we'll even see some deer in the Bigfoot or something. That'd be pretty neat. So I'm on a main like a ATV trail right now, which the game trails intersect this. So We look close enough, we may be able to find a game trail, but again, with all this, these leaves on the ground, it's hard to get a, a view for a good trail here. But we'll keep our eyes out. We've got all day. So I'm out here alone today. If you guys are going to look for sheds, so they said, you may want to bring a friend with you. You can cover more ground and kind of do like a grid search. Uh, like I said, it's kind of tough <clears throat> when it's just one of you. Where you gotta I'm trying to video and look at the ground and not, you know, trip and break something. But it is a pretty popular hot spot for bucks around here. Although it's not a huge piece of land, it uh, it definitely produces some big animals. Creek's running pretty nice. I can't believe it. somebody stole my bridge. Oh well. Okay, let's get back to hunting. So I found a nice little opening. Found some deer poop. So they're definitely coming through here. But it doesn't look like I could go through here much more. Tornado really tore this place up. I think what I'll do is I'll turn around and actually put the sun to my back. And here's more poop here. Not very fresh, but they're definitely coming through here. trees all overturned.
Definitely a good spot for the deer to come and hide though. There's a bone of some sort. Probably a deer bone. We'll look around and see if we can find anything else. squirrels or something. It might make this video uh, a lot more interesting. Or <laughs> find a shed antler. That would be uh, ideal too. I'll try to get through this. So I'm right dead in the middle of where this tornado came through. I mean it's almost like impassable. It's it's crazy the amount of devastation back here. And found some more poop, which is probably coyote, but I don't want to turn this into a poop video. So we're going to get through this somehow, and then we're going to get back to uh, searching for shed antlers. All right, well, I made it through that mess. I didn't find any antlers, just some poop, and I've got some really sweet pieces of uh, quartz crystals here. No gold in it though. I'll still take them home. Yeah, so I used to hunt back here. And I used to know this land like the back of my hand. But with all this devastation, it's hard to even recognize. And now all the game trails have interrupted, you know, disrupted here because of all the trees falling, so the deer are another way around. It seems like I'm on a good one here. We're going to check this one out. See what this garbage is over here. If you guys are walking through the woods and you find trash, just pick it up and stick it in your pocket and bring it home and throw it out. The animals will appreciate it. Alright. I found a tree that I did hunt out of before. See my steps in there? They're never coming out. But that's okay, because I know there's a good trail around here. So we'll try to hop on that. <clears throat> See what happens here to my right. There's a swamp in the middle. So you get this funnel effect. So the deer have no choice but to go to either left or the right of the swamp. So it's a good spot to set up a tree stand. Good spot to look for shed antlers too. I'm not going to take the hike all the way down to the swamp because it's starting to get late and I don't want to get be out there in the dark. There's actually there's another trail right here. So I'm going to take this so you can actually see the leaves are turned up here. And look at that. More poop. We got the poop shell. No antlers though. Blair Witch is now here. Okay, guys. I'm going to head back towards the houses to a particular hot spot because the neighbors have been feeding the deer and they've, they've been coming in for well over a month right now. Got herds of anywhere from 10 to 40 deer at least. I'll show you some pictures of the bucks later on. Some with antlers, some without, and some with one. They're, they're here. 
gotta be patient. There's nothing out here, I can't believe it. No squirrels, chipmunks, nothing. I hear one bird in the distance. The antlers, ha ha ha. Yeah, I got a feeling there'll be a lot of editing in this video. But maybe we'll find something. Just hang in there. Okay. Just gonna try down here. Now I'm gonna go to the hot spot. Burn. This trail is just too good to get off. Ooh, it's not an antler, but it's a job I need to do. Let's check it out. Hey, how's it going? How are you? I'm going to leave it here. I don't want to let that rest in peace. I told you it was a good trail. That yeah, is right into the swamp. I'm not going into. But we'll go to the edge of the swamp. That's all the antlers are in the swamp. Gotta be something. Oh, I could have just grabbed an antler from home put it in my pocket and threw it out here in the first five minutes and be like, hey, look what I found. But I didn't do that. So if I do find one, it's going to be totally legit. All right, I'm just going to say I was going to stop and keep going. So my next video is going to be about finding different kind of poop and rocks in the woods. That'll be a big hit. Okay. So here's a barn. See what happens is when the coyotes back here, they get them and they could just, not to be gross, but just tear them apart and then they could run around with the body parts so you find bones and stuff you typically don't find a full skeleton but it's close to an antler a nice trail goes through here trail of tears 